I brought some marbles to play with you. <laughs> Let's play marbles after lunch. Oh no! Marbles! Marbles, Tony! Oh, my marbles! Let's go and find the marbles. Choopy, 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 choo! To under the ground. of a tree. Cicada larva, cicada larva. I curled up myself to be a bigger me. Awesome cicadas, what a Have you seen our marble cicada larva? They rolled, rolled, rolled over, over there. I make a path where the ground brings Earthworm, earthworm, earthworm To make nutrients I eat rotten leaves and soil Rich ground with my sweat and toil Have you seen our marbles, earthworm? They rolled, rolled, rolled over, over there I dig an underground tunnel for food Mold, 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 mold So smell, I can dig the ground very well. Have you seen our marbles, Mole? They rolled, rolled, rolled over, over there. Where are our marbles? I'm very deep under the ground. Dinosaur fossils, dinosaur fossils. Look at my head, bone, back, bone, and tailbone. The coolest T-Rex fossils that you've known. Have you seen our marbles, dinosaur fossil? Oh, huh? the marbles are stuck in my tailbone. We found them! We all live under the ground. Cicada larva and earthworm. We live together under the ground. Mole and dinosaur fossils. Thank you, underground friends. <laughs> wasn't me. Animals do fart too. Woof woof! We dogs often fart when we eat in a hurry or breathe with our mouths open and breathe in a lot of air. Poo poo! Was my fart stinky? N not really. It wasn't that bad. If the fart smells worse than usual, the food isn't good for us or may mean we are sick. So please check my fart smell, will you? Huh? Uh, <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, what about skunks? Their farts are super stinky. Are they sick? Huh? No, no, we're fine. That stink isn't because of our farts. What is it then? I spray foul-smelling liquid from the small sacks next to the anus. I don't spray it any time. I raise my tail and spray only when I'm in danger. Because of its stink, everyone misunderstands my spray as a fart. <laughs> you were stinky to protect yourself. Wow, you're so brave. 
Oh, I know a friend who defeats an enemy with his farting noise. Do you want to meet him? Defeating with farting noise? <laughs> I can't wait to meet that farter. Did you say I'm a farter? When enemies or prey appear, we coral snakes suck air into our anus and fart continuously. While they are distracted by my farting noise, I bite them ah! with my scary poisonous teeth. I, I see. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I scared you, didn't I? I'll introduce you to a friend who communicates with farts. What? <laughs> hey, what's so funny? I am Herring, the blue fish of the sea. When a big fish appears and we feel danger, we Herring send the air stored in the air bladder out to the anus. It's how we fart. Boot! We fart with a unique sound in the water, and it creates air bubbles. We herrings can tell it's a dangerous situation by hearing it. It's a sign that only herrings can understand. It's really cool to protect themselves with farts, right, Junie? Yeah! <laughs> but I can't help but laugh whenever I hear farting noises! <laughs> Really? I'll make you laugh even harder! Let's go and meet a funny farting family! Who, who, farty fart? Who, who, farty fart? Lift your bottoms up, ready, fart! Who, who, farty fart? Who, who, farty fart? We are a farting family! Brap, brap, daddy farts, thunder fart! Daddy farts, bang, bang! Daddy farts, bang! Daddy farts, thunder fart. Daddy farts, bing, bing, bing. Yeah. Ring, ring, mommy farts, bicycle fart. Mommy farts, toot, toot. Mommy farts, toot. Ring, ring, mommy farts, bicycle fart. Mommy farts, toot, toot, toot. Toot. Keep, keep, baby farts, tick fart. Baby farts, pop, pop. Baby farts, pop. Keep, keep, baby farts, tick fart. Baby farts, pop, pop. Grandpa farts and take farts. Grandpa farts, squeak, squeak. Grandpa farts, squeak. Wobble, wobble, grandpa farts and take farts. Grandpa farts, squeak, squeak, squeak. Swing, swing, grandma farts, go farts. Quick shot, boom, boom. Quick shot, boom, boom. Swing, swing, grandma farts, go farts. Quick shot, boom, boom, boom. <laughs> farty fart. Oh, wait! Why do I smell poop? Ah! Is it dinosaur poop? Poop, poop, poop! Poop, poop, poop! Rainbow colored poop, poop, poop! Smelly, smelly, do, do, do! Eat your food and poop, 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 poop! Tyrannosaurus loves red! I love red! Yum, 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 yum! yum.
Quack! Quack! I'm T-Rex! Quack! There! T-Rex needs a crown! Huh? Why does T-Rex need a crown? Because Tyrannosaurus Rex is the king of the dinosaurs! Wow, really? Is it because it's good looking, smart, or strong like me? No wonder I love T-Rex the most! <laughs> hmm, let's find out why T-Rex is the king of the dinosaurs! Okay! Choopy 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 Choo! The Wheel of Dinosaurs! Powerful jaws, look my sharp and scary teeth. I'm a fierce hunter, the king of the dinosaurs. Boom shakalaka, T Rex shakalaka. Boom shakalaka, T Rex shakalaka. Keen eyes, keen nose, keen ears. I'm T Rex. My strong legs for speed. Look, my big tail for balance. I'm a fierce hunter. The king of the dinosaurs. Boom shakalaka, T-Rex shakalaka. Boom shakalaka, T-Rex shakalaka. Tyrannosaurus Rex, the king of the dinosaurs. Tyrannosaurus means tyrant lizard, and Rex means king. It's also called T-Rex for short. The Tyrannosaurus Rex is a carnivore that represents the Cretaceous period. It was very strong and had a strong jaw. T-Rex also had good eyesight, so it could easily hunt other dinosaurs. Oh, Tony! T-Rex is so cool! I'll be T-Rex from today! <laughs> Oh, so cold. Uh, Junie, do you see anything? <sighs> it's weird. Why isn't there a single penguin? You promised, achoo, to show me penguins today. <sighs> hmm. Ah, let's go and ask the polar bear over there. Hi, polar bear. Hi. Have you seen penguins today? No, I haven't. You guys look cold. Are you okay? Uh, I didn't know the North Pole was this cold. Achoo! Uh, it must be hard to live in this cold place. <laughs> I'm a polar bear. I have a lot of fat and layers of short and long hair. My short fur keeps my body warm, and my long hair keeps me from getting wet. You can stand the cold because of your hair. Yeah. Did you know that my skin color is black? I can stand the cold better because black skin absorbs sunlight and keeps my body warm. Really? Do you see the black soles of my feet here? The skin color inside the fur is the same. I see. By the way, you have very big feet. <laughs> my heavy body doesn't fall into the snow thanks to my two big feet. My feet are covered with tiny bumps, so I don't fall even on slippery snow. Oh, you were looking for penguins. Ask the Arctic fox over there. She might know. We will! Thank you, polar bear! Hi, Arctic Fox. Have you seen penguins today? <laughs> Who are penguins? Aw, you haven't seen them either. Wow, Junie! Arctic Fox is so cute! I agree. I'm cuter than the other foxes you know. Animals that live in cold places like us have blunt heads, snouts, and short legs so that we don't lose heat from our bodies. <laughs> That's cool! You are very white and furry! 
I can stand the cold well because I have a lot of hair and fat like polar bears. My white fur protects me from enemies at the snowy North Pole. If we play hide and seek with you, Arctic Fox, I don't think we'll find you. <laughs> But after the snow melts and winter passes, we change our fur clothes to another color. Oh, why don't you ask the walrus over there where the penguin is? Yeah! It, it was, was nice meeting you, Arctic Fox. Fox! Hi, walrus! Oh, hi, guys! You have ivories like elephants! Yeah! My ivories are also called morse. I use these as walking sticks when I walk and as hooks when I go up on the ice. And you have a lot of whiskers. Yes, I do. I have about 450 whiskers. They are so stiff that they are really useful for finding clams underwater. I do love clams. By the way, why did you call me? Oh, we wanted to ask you if you know where penguins are. Penguins? Penguins are not here. Uh, they're not? Nope. The penguins you're looking for live at the South Pole. This is the North Pole. What's going on, Junie? They live in cold places, so I thought they live at the North Pole, too. Thank you, Walrus. We're going to the South Pole. Okay. Goodbye. Choopy, 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 choo! To the South Pole! Achoo! Uh, the South Pole is colder. The South Pole is actually colder than the North Pole because it is covered with thick ice and cannot absorb warm solar heat. I read it in a book. Oh, do penguins live in this cold place? I really want to meet cute penguins. We have a lot of fat in our bodies, but it's not easy to overcome the cold alone at the South Pole. So we stick together. Penguin! Cute penguins were at the South Pole all along. Hi, I'm Emperor Penguin. I represent the South Pole. I look cute when I waddle with short legs, but when I go into the water, I'm a gentleman of the South Pole who swims fast. You are! You really look like a gentleman wearing a tuxedo! <laughs> By the way, is this your baby? The penguin following you? Yes, he is. It was hard to hold an egg on my feet while enduring the cold of the South Pole. I'm so proud that my baby came out of the egg in good health. What did Mother Penguin do? When Mother Penguin lays an egg and goes to eat, it's up to me, the father penguin, to hatch the egg. The egg doesn't freeze if we put it on our feet and incubate it with warm feathers. Whoa! You couldn't have been moving because of the egg. Nope. I incubate the egg for two months. I don't even eat anything. That's amazing! Hmm, I'm glad we came all the way to the South Pole to meet the penguins. Penguin is a true gentleman of the South Pole. <laughs> Am I? Guys, would you like to listen to the other animal dad stories who take care of their babies like penguins? From the river I'm a daddy stickleback I can't take my eyes off of you every day I fight to the end Even in any dangerous attacks I will protect you To make sure you're okay Podbellied I'm a daddy seahorse I endure rough flow Wind my tail to not be found I hide between water plants For your safety, of course I will wait for you To be born safe and sound I'm okay, I'm your dad Because I really love you I'm okay, I'm your dad Because I care about you 
It's because I'm your dad It's because you're my world It's because you're Everything to me From the North Pole I'm a daddy arctic wolf Despite the strong winds I go out to get food for you the only thing I want is your happiness, that's all my love for you is so tried and true. You must be hungry too. Oh, there's my dad! From the South Pole, I'm a daddy emperor penguin. I can't take my eyes off. Precious kid there has ever been I'll never let you go For you I'm here to stay I'm okay, I'm your dad Because I really love you I'm okay, I'm your dad Because I care about you It's because I'm your dad because you're my world It's because you're Everything to me I, 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 I'm a little cub I want to be like my mom when I grow up My mom can see well at night She hunts prey with all her might And her roars give others fright For me! My mom is who I want to be But I'm too small and I'm scared Never gave up, baby lion you are your mom's proud cub You'll roar like her soon yeah. And run fast too <gasps> So never give up, you're her precious cub You can be like your mom Yeah, I'll never give up, I'll grow up Into a great lioness For me, my mom is who I want to be. But I'm not as brave as my mom. Never give up, baby polar bear. You are your mom's proud cub. You'll swim like her soon. And hunt praise too. So never give up, you're her precious cub. You can be like your mom. a great polar bear.
Maybe. Oh, I think we're in the middle of the desert. There's something on your butt. <laughs> Can a fox live in such a hot place like here? Hi, I'm Fennec Fox, the smallest fox in the world. My ears are big compared to my small body, so I can radiate heat from my body. I can find food well because I can also listen to quiet sounds. Thanks to my big ears, I can live in this hot desert. Oh, you have long fur in your ears. Yeah, my fur protects my ears from the sand. My paws are also furry, so I can walk well without falling into the hot sand. That's amazing! Fennec Fox, please introduce us to the other animal friends living in the desert. Oh no, I need to sleep now to hunt at night. But sure! Who should I introduce first? Introduce me first! I, Camel, represent the desert. I'll tell you how I can live in a desert where water is precious. When I drink water, I drink a lot at once and let very little water out of my body so I can endure it without drinking water for at least four to five days to 20 days tops. Wow! Also, my eyelashes are long and I can open and close my nostrils freely to keep sand out. My feet are wide, so my feet don't fall into the sand. And my long legs help avoid the hot heat of the sand. Look how long my legs are! These are my ankles! <laughs> Whoa! I thought they were your knees! Whoa! You do have long legs! Camel, what is that thing sticking out on your back? It's my lovely and precious hump. Why is your hump precious? Ah, is it where you keep your treasure? <laughs> <laughs> kind of. My hump is full of fat. I eat branches or grass. And when there is no food in the desert, I can hold out thanks to the fat in the hump. Instead, the bump gets smaller and smaller. Aha! Just like Tony's tummy. Aw, Junie. <laughs> camels with one hump like me are called Arabian camels, and camels with two humps are called Bactrian camels. Hey, guys. I'll introduce myself, too. Hi. Who are you? Hi, Junie Tony. I'm Meerkat, the guard of the desert. I look around carefully and observe as guards do. You look like you're wearing sunglasses. <laughs> we can smell very well and find food in the ground with our long front toenails. But we can't look around when we find food, so we're vulnerable to predators. That's why we take turns standing guard. It's really cool that you guys cooperate. The desert is hot during the day and cold at night, so we enjoy the sun outside the cave by sunrise. Do you see the dark stripes on my back? They help me to absorb lots of sunshine. Now I know how meerkats can live in the desert. Wait! I'll introduce myself, too. <laughs> it's a scorpion! Yeah! I'm Scorpion, with a pointed poison stinger. <laughs> In fact, I'm a nocturnal animal who rests under stones or the ground during the day and goes hunting at night. But I came out since I represent the desert. Uh, <laughs> thank you, I guess. We walk lightly on the sand with a pair of big front claws and eight legs. How cool am I? Even though I can't see well, I can feel the vibration of the ground with my body. So hunting is no problem. My body is piled up in hard shells, which is why I can live in the desert. These shells keep the water in my body. Front claws and hard shells, you look like a crayfish. Nah, are 
you serious? Can't you see this scary poisonous stinger at the end of my curved tail? <laughs> oh, yeah. I found a yummy scorpion here. Uh, uh. Huh? What? A scorpion? Uh. Aww, stop, stop right, right there! there. <laughs> the scary scorpion's natural enemies were fennec foxes and meerkats. <laughs> The hot desert, I love hot sunshine. I am Bumpy Camel with a huge hump. Big enough to keep my bath full of nutrients. Here I am, the camel, the humpy camel. I love the hot desert, I love hot sunshine. I am meerkat, sting alert all day. Desert, I love hot sunshine. I am scorpion with a pair of claws. Watch out for my stinger at the end of my tail. Here I am, the scorpion, the scary scorpion. I love the hot desert. I love hot sunshine. I am Bennett Fox with large ears. Sleeping in my den by day, catching prey by night. Here I am, the Bennett Fox, the cute Bennett. Shall I eat today? Oh, I smell something yummy! Hmm. <laughs> Welcome to the fly trap! <laughs> Let me taste it! <laughs> why, why is it closed? <laughs> <laughs> you can't get out! I'll melt you with my strong digestive enzymes and eat you! Eat me? Where is Junie? I'm here, Tony! I'm trapped here! Get me out of here, please! Is she in her room? Aw, oh, too bad he couldn't hear you! <laughs> no! Tony! Tony! Junie? <gasps> Tony! I became a fly in my dream! So I sat on a leaf, but then that plant tried to eat me! <laughs> it was so scary! <gasps> Oh, you had a dream about a Venus flytrap. A Venus flytrap is a plant that eats bugs or insects. A bug-eating plant? No way! That's impossible! Huh? It's true! Bugs are my favorite food! <gasps> when a bug attracted by my fragrant smell sits on my leaf blade, I quickly close it. Then I melt the bug with my digestive enzymes and eat it. But like this! Ah! You surprised me! Wow! How do you know a bug is sitting on you? Thanks to my pointy hair on my leaf blades, I can notice that the prey is sitting on me. When a bug even slightly touches my leaf blade, that's how I know. And I close the leaf. Wow! It's amazing to catch prey that way. Thank you. Let me introduce you to my friends who hunt bugs in different ways. This is a sundew with a lot of thin hair on its leaves. The dragonfly is stuck on the sundew. The sundew's leaves are covered in hairs that ooze a sticky, sweet-smelling fluid. Bugs or insects attracted by the sweet scent approach and stick to the sundew. You can do it, dragonfly! <laughs> No, he can't. The more he moves to escape, the more sticky water Sundew spouts from the tip of its hair. Sundew would curl up its hair or roll a leaf blade and never miss the dragonfly. Ugh, it's as scary as a Venus flytrap! <sighs> ah, 
Something smells good in here. <laughs> the ant fell into a plant that looks like a pitcher. That is a tropical pitcher plant. It is also known as a monkey cup. The name comes from monkeys occasionally drinking the fluid found in the pitchers. It actually looks like a cup. The tropical pitcher plant also attracts bugs or insects with its sweet smell. Bugs or insects smelling this plant fall into the tube because of the slippery edges. What if they jump high and come back up? The tube is very deep, and there is a lot of fluid that melts bugs, so it's hard to come out again once they fall into it. By the way, why do you eat bugs? Other plants usually get nutrients from the ground. But we Venus flytraps live on the ground where there aren't enough nutrients. That's why we eat bugs to get nutrients and to survive. My favorite prey is here. Shall I attract it with my fragrant smell? What? Hold your nose, Tony, so that the Venus flytrap won't attract us! Oh, Junie. You're not an insect. Trapping plants? Yeah! Pitcher plants! Once you come in, you can never get out! Yeah! Pitcher plants! Sweet and sticky nectar, insect collector! Here it comes! A pitcher looking pitcher plant! Have you ever heard of pre snapping plants? Yeah! Venus flytrap! my mouth, you can never get out. Yeah, Venus flytrap. Spikes along the edge, yummy insects I catch. Here it comes, a jolly Venus flytrap. Never get away! Yeah! Yeah! Sundew! Sticky water-like leaves You can never leave Here it comes! A raindrop-looking sundew I can catch mosquitoes I can catch flies I can catch frogs We're the insect-eating plants <laughs> There's the sweet house I've been looking for. Knock, 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 please open the door. It's me, your friend, Puppy. Open the door. Ow! No, no, you're not our friend, Puppy. Puppy would say woof, 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 woof. Knock, 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 please open the door. It's me, your friend, Kitty. Open the door. Ow! No, no, you're not our friend, Kitty. Kitty would say meow, 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 meow. Knock, 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 please open the door. It's me, your friend, Cow. Open the door. Ow! Open the door, it's me, your friend, Piglet. Open the door. Ow! No, no, you're not our friend, Piglet. Piglet would say, oink, 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 oink. Knock, 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 please open the door. It's me, your friend, Bumblebee. Open the door. Ow! Thing. You are my everything You are an angel with no 
are the cutest thing You are my everything You make my heart go zing, zing, zing You make my day, you are my world Squishy, squishy toe beans Chubby, chubby tummy With no toes, guess who I am? 
I am a jelly-like octopus I have no nose or toes I can smell and taste with my suckers instead Perfect cat you've ever seen. 
going on? La la la, dee 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 dee. I can't wait to go home and eat the. Huh? Oh, what happened? My house? Where did my house go? <laughs> what happened, raccoon? Are you okay? <laughs> Somebody got rid of my wooden house! I have no place to live! <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Let's ask our animal friends for help! Great idea! They will build a nice house for you! La 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 la, animal's place! La 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 la, wonderful space! is the only kind I do. Stretching, silky, sticky web. Making an awesome web step by step. Yo, heave, ho, spin the web. Dance, Lee, and finally, weave the web. Ha! Bugs stick to this tight net. Ah, help! Sticky, sticky, wonderful. Spider's cup web. Wow! <laughs> this house is too I'll build a house for you! Grinding wood for the lodge on stream Collecting logs for the house of your dream Pile up and up, one by one Fill up and up, more mud No one can get in easily Huh? Where's the entrance? Piled up and up with logs and mud Beaver's Lodge But this house is too damp! <laughs> I'll build a house for you! Digging the ground with my front paws Burrowing underground tunnels with my claws Dig a tunnel here and there Deep and dark everywhere Welcome to a long and winding maze Wow! How do we get out? Wavy, squiggly, underground most mazy house uh, It's too confusing! I love it! This will be my new house! Now, where should I move to? Black and white long stripes Zebra has stripes Black and white from top to toe Zebra has stripes when I'm with my family, the lions cannot find me. That makes me special. Zebra has stripes. Golden fur and black spots. Cheetah has spots. They are round like little dots. Cheetah has spots. See the black streaks on my face? They are not from my tears. That makes me special. Cheetah has spots. Special. Special. Show. Golden fur and black rosettes Leopard has rosettes They look like black roses Leopard has rosettes You can never find me when I'm hiding in the bush That makes me special Leopard has rosettes Beautiful feathers Peacock has eye spots Brilliant colors Peacock has eye spots When I spread my fan you will fall in love with me That makes me special Peacock has eye spots Special 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 
It's me, the careful cat. Meow, meow, meow. Fun animal choir. Oink, oink, quack, quack. Fun animal choir. Woof, woof, meow. It's me, the singing sparrow. Tweet, 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 tweet. It's me, the leaping frog. Croak, croak, croak. It's me, the bearded goat. Bleat, bleat, bleat. It's me, the spotted cow. Tweet, tweet, crow, crow, fun animal choir. Bleep, bleep, moo, moo. Today we'll meet four animals in the Animal World Records. First of all, Skunk. I am Skunk, Farter Skunk, a famous farter. I am Skunk. It's my weapon, the smelly, smelly smells. I am ostrich who cannot fly. I have beautiful big eyes. I can see things that are far away. Oh, you winked at me. I'm the one who sees the best. Let's meet the next animal in the animal world records. Cheetah! I am Cheetah, runner Cheetah, a nimble runner. I am Cheetah, no one can beat me at running on the ground. Me if you can. I'm the one with the fastest feet. I'm Blue Whale, King Blue Whale, King of the Sea. I'm Blue Whale. I'm the biggest animal on Earth. But I will never hurt you. I'm the biggest of them all. The Animal World Records. Let's give it a try. Welcome back to Animal World Records. Meet today's four animals. First of them is the sailfish. Hello, hello, I am a sailfish. Sailfish! The fastest swimmer in the sea. Sailfish! Cheetahs on land, fountains in the sky. Look at my slim body, it's good for speed. And here I am, the sailfish in the sea. Sailfish! Hello, hello, I am a blobfish. Be my interesting face. Blobfish. Squishy, squishy body. Blobby, blobby face. But I look cute, right? No. <sighs> I call the ugliest animal in the world. Blobfish. The next animal in the animal world records is the sloth. Ba 